Okay, so this is my new home. There's going to be a restaurant in here. We've got bikes parked in there now. And uh, I am on the corner of Anthong 21 and Anthong 20. This is the building here. It goes up quite a bit. And my apartment is the one with the open window right up there. It's a beautiful apartment and it's just one floor up to a big spacious roof deck up there. My neighborhood here there's a little convenience store across the street but I'm gonna go walk and show a little bit more of the neighborhood up here. It's sort of a main street and there's lots of uh, uh, there's a nice, nice little convenience store here as well you can get a drink or something. But I'm gonna go up and show that there's a coffee shop on the corner probably going to be some something constructed here and then if you go around the corner there's a bunch of little uh, stores and restaurants and plenty to go and get your snacks and a bite to eat if you don't want to drive somewhere so this main street right here you see the bikes on goes out to not far out that direction is uh, the main road that goes across one of the main bridges. We call it the Sail Bridge. don't really remember the name exactly of the bridge in Vietnamese, but it looks like a big uh, sail because it's, uh, the spans are uh, in the shape of a, of a sailboat sail. Hot Talk is a haircutting place right in front of us. And then there's a nice coffee shop right here. And as you go down the street here, there's a bunch more. A little restaurant here. Hang's Kitchen. Western Mexican. I love, all right. I got some Western food right here in my neighborhood. And then I've got a Lucky Spa to get a uh, foot massage or maybe even a body massage. Back, neck, shoulder massage, shampoo, hot stone, body and foot massage. I like it. Going down. My haircut place right there, and then uh, over on this side again, we've got a little cafeteria, and some more, and some more, and some more. There's plenty down here, and then uh, my friend Jason is right about three streets to the left. There's a corner up here I can go and drive right up to where he is and he can probably walk down to my place and if there's stuff up near his place I know there's a big uh, uh, big restaurant right across the street from where he's living you can go up there and have uh, some food but there's a lot of western food and international food uh, modern restaurants out on the main street that uh, crosses that bridge so there's another little cafe and if I can get the uh, bikes past me, I'll go across the street and check out some other. There we go, a nice little cafe here. Coffee everywhere in Vietnam. Everywhere, everywhere. Right up there, a few blocks. But actually, there's a main road up here. I can go up to my friend Jason's place. You can walk to the beach from here pretty easily. It'd be a nice little walk. And um, along the way, there's a lot of restaurants and shops. And it'd be a very nice little place to be. So, so some more restaurants down here. So this is the extent of my neighborhood. Let's see. And uh, very friendly people, very nice. Uh, what do we have here? Another spa. I don't know. Mr. Bu, what is he? Vietnam Foods. There's plenty of that around here. And maybe a little place to get motorcycles fixed right here yep if i have any problems with my bike i can literally wheel it over here and get it worked on and it just goes on and on and on and on, and on. but you notice that this street is a little bit loud when you get back to my street it's very quiet very i'm gonna video all the way back but i'll probably fast forward through some of this you get back to my street my little side street it's extremely quiet. There's not much traffic going by at all. And there's not any construction going on down there. So it's, it's quiet to be in the apartment. 
I have another video or two of the apartment I'll I'll sink in with this one and make one big video but I just love these little places everybody's just kind of chilling out here and and uh, it's got a nice vibe to it okay, we're gonna walk back go down my street Haircut. Any way you want it. Oh, and they do the they do the ear cleaning. That's it. I'll be coming there. And uh, and they do haircut there, and they do uh, probably a face mask. Just chill right out there, and it's nice. And the weather here, it's uh, coming up on noon, so it's maybe the hottest part of the day. We're close to it. And the weather here is fine. I'm actually wearing a long sleeve because on the bike I don't want my arms to burn and I am very comfortable out here. This is, there's a constant breeze and in these side neighborhoods, that breeze kind of swirls around. It's coming from different directions that I walk, but it's a very mild breeze, but it just keeps the air moving on you and uh, you don't get hot, even in the sun. A lot of these older buildings will be either renovated my friend Jason's in one that was renovated. It looks like a brand new building, but it's like one of these old buildings like the one in front of me there. It's done really nicely. And uh, he's got a great deal in his. Uh, quite a bit less than I'm paying, but it's a studio. Mine's sort of a quasi-studio because it's, uh, it's very open to the bedroom. They offered me, do you want um, doors put in to close off the bedroom? And as you'll see in the video of mine, you really wouldn't want that. You just leave it open as a, as a, uh, again, I'm going to call it a quasi-studio. It's, um, the bedroom uh, has a quite a wide opening into the main living area. There's the building coming up again. My rental bike sitting there. But that's a brand new building right there. It looks quite nice. And the apartments are very modern, very western super clean and very very well uh, appointed and, and decorated and laid out and so you can see down this street there's one bike going by and now it's nice and quiet and the little side street there is quiet looking back up to the main street it's quiet there's no noise here at all so this unit here is about 500 and uh, it's got a nice little living room area as you walk in I'm not sure where the TV is is it in the bedroom but uh, Nice little sitting area here by the window and a very cool little kitchen. It's very bright, lots of light. The windows open, the shelves there, nice fridge, microwave underneath, stove top there, a nice uh, bathroom with a washer in it, corner uh, shower stall with window opening there. I love all the windows. It's $500. It's amazing. You know, in Cebu, you wouldn't get this. And uh, it's quiet here. And then we went to the bedroom. It's very open. So the bedroom is right here. There's your TV. And look at this window at this end of the room. It's, it's big, it's floor to ceiling. You can see the whole neighborhood. And the beach is right beyond those buildings over there. So this is back a little bit from the beach, but it's on the beach side. Da Nang is set up. See the See the big Ferris wheel over there. Denang is set up uh, with um, two sides, the city side and the beach side. So here is the bedroom in here. There's plenty of storage. That's a slip type air con up there. I'm not sure if that's the only, no, there's another one out in the living room. And it's a very nice little sitting area. I really feel like this is a comfortable, zen, warm, cool space that I could really enjoy.